This is a photograph of Franz Liszt in about 1880 uh, after he'd smoked an awful lot of cigarettes in his life. And this shows typical changes of the eyelid margins due to chronic smoking. This is the left eyelid which is looks watery and this is very typical in smokers with the lacrimal gland switching on from the nicotine level in the blood. If you look at the lower eyelid margin you can see full thickness notches and dimples and posterior notches mainly on the nasal side and this is from where the eyelids get squeezed. Um, the outer part, the temporal part of the eyelid doesn't get squeezed, it simply gets stretched. If you look at the other eye, this is the right eye, very similar story here. Okay, and you can see the notches quite easily. Um, and underneath the notch, we've done my boscopy on poor old Franz Liszt, you'll see that most of the meibomium glands will have died. Smoking increases meibomium gland death by about threefold.